I couldn't believe he found me. Motorcycle rider involved in a horrific crash tracks down the good Samaritan who kept him alive until paramedics arrived. A motorcycle rider who was sent flying off his bike and left stranded after colliding with a car in front of him has tracked down the woman who stayed with him until paramedics arrived. Nathan Gut Stafford was left lying in agony on Enerley Road in Brisbane, but he didn't suffer alone with a good Samaritan stopped to help him until paramedics arrived, reported the Canberra Times. Mr. Gut Stafford was sent flying over his handlebars on Tuesday. May 29 on his way to work after being distracted by a car that had appeared to have had something caught underneath. After being distracted for only a few seconds, he looked up and saw that traffic had stopped, colliding with the car in front of him. Mr. Gut Stafford managed to fling himself forward on impact, before bouncing off the car's boot before landing on the road. He remained still, not wanting to move due to the pain in his back. The first person who came to me was Rachel who called the ambulance and the second person was Kylie who stayed with me from the start, Mr. Gut Stafford said. Kylie Hurd, who works as a nurse, stayed next to him for about 15 minutes of the painful and upsetting period, doing anything she could to distract him. She ensured he remained calm and felt safe before the ambulance arrived and transferred him to Prince Alexandra Hospital. Mr. Gut Stafford was treated for a sprained back and whiplash. Upon his release from hospital, he appealed on Facebook to find Dems Heard, wanting to thank her face to face. The post was shared over 450 times, and eventually paid off, as Ems Heard was alerted to the post by a friend who recognized her instantly due to the red hair. She instantly messaged Mr. Gut Stafford, bewildered that he managed to find her. I ran across to him and my partner directed traffic. My main priority was to keep him distracted because he was quite distressed, so I talked his ear off and waited for the ambulance," she said. Once Mr. Gut Stafford had been assisted by paramedics, Ems Heard continued on her way, yet considered searching for him in hospital in the following days. The two planned to meet in person next Saturday, June 16.